Well, come on in out of that uh, cold, snowy weather that we're having today. Well, actually, it was, uh, I think it was in the 60s today. Probably going to be in the 60s tomorrow. But anyway, uh, come on in. Let's take a look at your inspection report. So stay with me. Okay, now let's take a look at the inspection report and see how it reads out. This is a generic report. This is exactly what you will get, only your information obviously will be filled into all these blanks. The upper right-hand corner of the report is the legend. Each one of these initials pertain to something. A is consistent with the age of the chimney. B, C comments below. C, repairs needed. D, need further evaluation or E, not applicable. And they're placed into the boxes next to the parts of the chimney that can be easily identified in this diagram. And then, of course, you'll find my comments here below. Now, let's take a look at your particular, your personal report. So stay with me. Hey, Sandra. It was great to see you out at the house today and meet with your client. Uh, what a beautiful house. Great location, too, by the way. Uh, if we go outside, look up, uh, we get some pictures here of the, uh, the top of your chimney. It has a, uh, a nice stainless steel chimney cap up there keeping the birds, the rain, and the squirrels out. This picture shows you how dark and dreary it was today. Boy, it was, it was a rainy day. But anyway, that's what you have, and it looks good up there. On the inside, a uh, working set of vented gas logs, beautiful gas log set. This uh, key valve on the side here is strictly a, a service valve now. It used to be associated with a, a log lighter for wood burning, but now that you've got gas logs in here, it's strictly a service valve. It's not for the customer to, um, to turn on and off. Once it's turned on and the logs are lit, uh, that's the, that key never needs to be turned again unless by a service provider. These are pictures of uh, the inside. This is the smoke chamber area and the flu system itself. If you folks have questions for me, give me a call, 704-526-6348. You can email me at chris at affordablesweep.com. Thank you.